1954, the British engineer Ari Patlom noticed an interesting thing, which will later be called blue energy. If salt and fresh water solutions are separated with a thin, semi-permeable membrane, water will naturally move from the less salty side to the more salty side. The flow of water through the membrane creates pressure on one side, which can be used to power turbines and generate electricity. So the concept of so-called blue energy or osmosis energy appeared. Against the background of global warming, overthinking regarding decarbonization and fear of gas blackmail, which shocked many, blue energy has all chances to become a new trend. Well, indeed, we live on a planet that is 70% water. Well, it sounds sexy, doesn't it? The French Climate Technology Center Switch Energy decided that the blue energy can become the new green, and it managed to convince investors. Now the producers have 6 million euros for developing a system for generating electricity from salt water suitable for everyday use. Every year, almost 30,000 terawatts per hour of osmotic energy are being released from deltas and river mouths around the planet. That is more than the global demand for electricity. It looks like this technology could really solve humanity's need for energy. But there's just still a small thing left to master and scale the production.